they are giving me this mascot of Forever Young, literally. It's like I am the Dorian Gray in real life, but it's a title that no one can keep, right? I still can remember that fateful morning when I woke up to a root shock and um, yeah, tons of messages from strangers all around the world even TV station, uh, even like a notable uh, news website they were all asking all sorts of things so at that moment, I, I felt like whoa, like I've been betrayed by the world like I, I felt as if I'm a criminal being out I was really scared. I stayed at home for a good two weeks. I didn't get out of the house. On the contrary to what people might believe, I'm actually a true blue introvert. I'm really shy and too shy for my own good, I would say that. This constant question that being asked that I get, like, what's your secret? What do you do? Eventually, it gets into me. I, I do feel the pressure. Maybe they all want a shortcut, a secret to how to keep their youth, right? Deep inside, I know I'm not that young. I know myself, I'm aging. As much as I don't think I look that young, I could be a person who um, look like a healthy version of someone of my age. Basically, what you think and what you, what, how you feel, that emotion is already reflected on your face. Every time we hear people say that, oh, you look very good today, you look happy. So that statement alone, right, already explains so much about this. I think with that understanding, isn't it good that if, let's say, we can, we can cite ourselves to have that mindset, that to have a positive, healthy, young thinking, I think through a period of time that feeling will eventually become you. I would be lying if I say that it never crossed my mind that I want to learn how, to, how not to age. But you know, this is something that you can't because aging is inevitable. I would say that I'm no different from anyone else. Um, by the time I reach 60, I mean of course I'm still going to do whatever I love photography and my businesses and all that. But I would like to take it more easy. I would love to visit the world and then perhaps continue to inspire people with my routine, with my exercises and all that. And that would be a dream come true.